Okay, my name is Justin Brightup, and I am here today to review a Leader More, or Lead More, or however you say it, I think it's Lead More, Bike Pump Mini. And this is something I've been wanting because um, I wanted a bike pump that I could take with me on my bike. The other one I got just wasn't for that. So here we go. We're going to open this up, and uh, we'll see how well it works, too. Come on. There we go. Looks really like it's a good quality product, it looks like. We'll see. We'll try it out. All right, so let's get some pictures of it here. Got so many cardboard fragments on my table here from opening things. I might have to wash this cover for my table. All right, so... I'll take a picture here, and there we go. Okay, let's take this apart, let's take it out, see if we can get the bag open without an eye. Oh, it has parts. Okay, so here we go, we got plastic bag, we have parts. I don't know what they're all for. I guess this is to mount to your bike, evidently. I don't know where you mount it. Maybe there's some instructions? No? So there's two screws and two rings, but I guess you got to drill the holes for the screws. I'm not sure what they want you to do with that. I like this the way it is. I I think I would just throw it in a place on my bike, but we'll see. We'll see how all this works. With this thing, I might be able to tie strap it in on the bike that I have. Um, oh goodness, that goes in the top. That fits interesting. Okay, and then this comes out, doesn't it? Does it twist? How does it? Okay, now I'm a little, oh, like this. Okay, the whole top. All right, that's kind of strange. Okay, and then I guess this goes under your shoe to help keep the thing upright. If you don't get your foot in this thing and pinch it, you can pinch yourself with this. Um, here we go. Let's get some pictures. But I guess that's just one of the one of the things about having something that's portable like this and small is that there's going to be some trade-offs. And it says B O I I, and I don't know what that means. Um, the Bowie pump? I don't know. There it is. And we'll get a picture of the attachments. We also have, for pumping up balls and stuff, we have a needle in here as well. Um, it says made in China, but it does not. And then it shows a picture. Um, let's see if I can figure this out and decipher it. Okay, so this is supposed to go on beside, like if you have a little thing that goes up on your bike, you set this on there and then you put the holes and the screws through it and you put it on your bike. Um, but like I said, I've got more room on my bike because I've got a basket in the front and the back and so I can put this um, in the basket, hopefully, and that will, of course it's going to want to move around so I have to secure it, but... Um, and that's why this comes into play. I should be able to tie strap this and then clamp and it should it should go in there. So let's go out and try it out on my flat tire on my Nissan Pathfinder and see how it works. Okay. It's probably not going to be as easy to use as the big one. But this one I can take with me on my bike, which is what I like. It doesn't have a gauge or anything built into it, but it should get the job done and I can get a small gauge a tire pressure gauge and I can bring it with me put it with this it's not a big deal
So it did take a while to get it pumped up because it's a smaller pump and it is warm. I don't think I wore it out. Um, it's not as hot as the big one was. The big one, the big pump when I took it off of there, there must have been a considerable more amount of friction because the big bike pump was really hot on the bottom. Um, this one, it got hot in the metal area, not in the plastic or the bottom. That's all nice and cool. It's just this cylinder that goes up and down that got that got hot. So I like this. I think this is a good way to test them out because if I can pump up a large tire with one of these and it doesn't fall apart and break, then it's probably not going to. Um, so this should be good, should be dependable. I'll put it with all my bicycle stuff for when I want to go out um, biking. I don't think I'm going to leave it out in the weather. Um, but anyways, thanks for watching the video. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe, and click the links in the description of the video. May Jesus bless you. Welcome to another episode of Justin's Epic Amazing Reviews. Now, check this out. I've got over 14 packages that I'm supposed to be reviewing. I don't know how I'm going to get them all done today. But look at this. They just The packages, they just keep coming and coming and coming. And I want them to keep coming. So please keep sending your packages. The address is in the description of this video.